everyone, it's Julia Elise. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, hey, what's up? Nice to meet ya, I'm Julia Elise. Don't wanna bug you, just wanted to invite you to subscribe. I think by now you know that it's down below, so go click that button, make my life. I know you hate intros, so I'm gonna make it short and sweet. Today I am doing a Rue 21 haul, so I have some really, really bad news. My Rue 21 is going out of business, and I am so really, really just, so sad, I love Rue 21, they have the cutest stuff. I know I've done um, collective hauls, including some items from Rue 21, but I thought in honor of the store that I've been shopping at for a while, I needed to make a whole video just dedicated to that store's life. So, RIP to my Rue 21. You must know by now that um, I love a good sale. Store closing equals good sale. It's a lot, just preparing you. Wanted to remind you that I'm hosting a giveaway. I'm not gonna talk too much about it, but I will leave a card and I'll link it down below, but I'm giving away two Amazon gift cards. So if you haven't entered, it's closing soon. Go check it out. Subscribe to my vlog channel. Follow me on social media. And I think that about covers it all. So without further ado, I do have a shopping problem. Do not judge me, just enjoy. <gasps> Just keep on watching. So normally I'm super organized in my hauls, like I'll start with shirts or pants or sweatshirts, but this is just too much stuff. So we're just gonna be going through this stuff randomly. But I will start with the stuff on hangers because that means I've been accumulating this stuff for the longest. The first top is this really pretty navy blue peasant shirt. And I love this so much because it's a little bit peplum but it's not like an obnoxious amount. And this is the Sadie Robertson line and I absolutely love her stuff. Isn't she the girl from Duck Dynasty, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure she is. So it's just this really, really cute navy blue top. This is in a size medium and it was $7.50. This next top I have is this gorgeous black t-shirt. I really love the lace up detail. I feel like it's super in style and it's just, it's so me, it hurts. Again, in a size medium and this was $5 on sale. So I really, really like that and I just been wearing this a poop ton. This next shirt is a shirt that you have seen probably a lot. I wear it in my vlogs, which you can go check out if you want, but it is this ACDC t-shirt. I know literally one song from ACDC, but I'm all about band tees. This was literally $4 and it's in a size extra small, so it's not really my size, but I wanted it, I saw it, and I bought it. This next top I've been wearing so much, it's a really 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 light weight sweatshirt which I love and it's this interesting green color it's not quite army but it's not I don't know Ew, it matches my uh, tapestry actually and it's in a size medium and I got this for six dollars this next top I got is a t-shirt and it says love by the moonlight I actually wore this when I was decorating for my best friend's birthday I love moons so much. Um, I tell you guys this all the time. So I, when I saw this t-shirt, I just had to get it. And this was only $4 in a size medium. I got this adorable cropped hoodie. I think this may have been the most expensive thing in my haul. It was $11. I know I'm a big spender, but I just saw it and I thought it was really perfect sweatshirt for spring and summer. It's right at the waist, so it's not cropped or anything. And it has little ties and a yin yang, which I love those. I've actually Instagrammed in this a few times too, and I got this in a size extra small, like my sizes literally in this haul are ranging from an extra small to an extra large, which just kind of goes to show that like size does not matter, you just get what's cute, and if it sort of fits you and it's on sale, go for it. That's not from Rue 21. Get out of there. So I picked up this really pretty off-white top but it has like lace detailing on the bottom and I just think it's so gorgeous I'm absolutely in love with it and it's super lightweight so again for spring with a skirt with pants whatever so adorable I got this in a size medium and it was on sale for $6.50 so I thought that was really great me and my mom share clothes so I just saw both of us wearing this a lot so had to get that I grabbed another off-white shirt because like just what I needed but I loved this one so much so it's just this oversized knit top which I think is really cute and this is also in the brand Sadie Robertson and this is in a size small seven dollars I also picked up some bathing suits which was really exciting so the bathing suits were a little bit more expensive because they were only 30% off I believe but they were still really reasonable this is gonna be really hard to show off-camera but you'll see it 
So it is just this really sporty high neck bikini, but in the back it's all super strappy. I just fell in love with the cut of this. I haven't seen a lot like this. The 30% off I can't do in my head, so it's 30% off of 17. So I thought that was really good. Um, it seems like it's really great quality, so I was really excited about that bikini top. So the bottoms I am so pumped about. They are these high-waisted bikini bottoms, and I'm so obsessed with these. They have little slit outlinings on the side, which is really cute. So I initially thought that like my uh, problem areas might be like spilling out of the sides, but I actually found that the cutouts were kind of needed, otherwise it would look a little bit diapery. So all around, this bottom is just really, really nice, and both the top and bottoms were in a size medium, 30% off of $16.99, really reasonable. And since I liked the swimwear so much and I had no idea they had such nice swimwear, they're going out of business, I had to pick up another top. So I picked up this high neck tie-dye bikini, which is really cute. And it has the cutouts again, but up the front. So I think that this would look really cute with those bottoms as well. Even though it's navy, the ties are black. So I guess you could make it work. And it's, you know, that high neck thing going on. I'm so excited about this. So I was rummaging through the clearance like, what else is new and I saw this jumpsuit that I'm obsessed with like it's not gonna even show so I'm not gonna even waste my time trying to show it to you guys but it's so cute it has straps but it's off the shoulders and it has a ruffle and I was like this is so elegant I had nowhere to wear this but I was hoping that I could maybe dress it down so I don't know we'll see but I got this in a size small for ten dollars so if any male members of my family are watching this sorry but I picked up a two pair of underwear Two pairs of underwear. Two pair? Two pairs. Two pairs. I picked up undies. And they look just like the ones I get from Victoria's Secret. So I went ahead and I got this really pretty mauve color. And it says, oh, it says drop it like it's hot. I also got this really pretty purpley gray color. So, and they are just identical to the ones I get from Victoria's Secret. So I figured give them a try. If I liked them, I'd go pick up more. Again, I got these in a size medium and they were a dollar. So yay. Next item I got, I absolutely love. Until I realized what it said, but I was too far in love with it for me to change my mind. So I got it anyway. It's this really cute cropped sweatshirt, but there is like a cutout in the front and there's a cutout in the back and it has like this built-in choker thing. It is so awesome, except for the fact that it says slay all day. I mean, it could say worse things, but slay all day is just kind of like conceited and like I never slay all day. Like I'll slay for maybe 30 minutes a day and then the rest of the day I'm a potato. I saw it and I wanted it, so I got it. And it is in a size medium and I got this for $7, so. I really liked it and I actually thought it looked like something you could pick up from like PacSun or something, so. Next I got another kind of at the waist hoodie, which I really liked. It's super lightweight and it has these gray and navy stripes, which I don't have a lot like this. And I just bought a, bought a pair of navy pants that I really like. So, so soft and cozy. I got this in a size medium, again, 750. This next top I grabbed, I am in love with. So I've been really, digging this color lately. I don't know what it is. It's like a denim blue. It's just so gorgeous. I have shoes this color. It just laces up the front and then it has these bell sleeves, which is so cute, so 70s. And it's this really dressy material that is great for traveling because it does not wrinkle. So I'm really excited to be just rocking this with a pair of white jeans. Love this. I got this in a size large for $5. This is wrinkled, but I grabbed this top. It is this really pretty maroon tie-dye shirt, and it's long, it's like a tunic, so I could wear it with leggings, leggings over jeans, all day, every day. Laces up the front, which I'm really in. Um, the price was ripped off. I guess I paid $3.99 for this. Bangin'! I bought, I purchased this blue tee and it is really large. It's an extra large, which I'm not saying extra large is big. It just fits my shoulders a little off the shoulder, but I love this top so much. I would not get it in any other size. I'm pretty sure the shirt's supposed to be fitted anyway, but it has a pocket and it's a nice blue color and I'm talking way too much about a t-shirt, but this was $5 and um, I've worn this a lot already. If you followed me on Instagram, you would know this. Three pairs of pants. I have fallen in love with every pair of pants I've I've ever gotten from Rue 21. So first and foremost, I got these white jeans, which I'm so excited because I was in desperate need of a pair of casual white jeans. And they have one, two, three, four, five buttons up the front, which is one of my favorite styles 
Ever since I was in middle school, I loved anything that buttons up the front. If it was in style, if it was an out of style, I don't care. I love that style. So I paid $9 for these. They are in a size 7, 8. Um, they were the only pair. I tried them on. They fit. I was pretty happy. I picked up a pair of light, well they're like medium wash denim and they have rips in them which I love. I love ripped jeans more than regular jeans and they are the, by the brand Wanna Betta Butt. <laughs> Wanna bet a butt? I can't say that with a straight face. Love these and they do do, they do do. They do wonders for your booty, which is always a good thing. You don't want a saggy booty. I got these in a size five and the rips are just perfectly placed. So whoever designed these, you go girl or boy. Finally, I got another pair of jeans, but these are by the brand 21 Black. So I'm guessing it's just like Rue 21's. Uh, brand situation there. So they just have one rip, which I've been looking for a pair of jeans with just run one rip in the knee. They're adorable and they have the rip right in the perfect spot. They're a nice dark wash, which I didn't have. For all of my jeans, I paid $9, which I think is very reasonable. I'm very excited. I got some accessories because I love Rue 21 accessories. First and foremost, I got this hat and everybody was yelling at me for saying that I have a small head in my wish video. So, okay, I will not say that I have a small head. I have an odd shaped head where hats just don't fit my head. So, I saw this hat and I fell in love with it. It's denim, it says mermaid off duty, and it fits, so I don't know. Oh my god, I just love this hat. It's so cute. I love what it says. It's gonna be so adorable with like an all black bathing suit or just like with an outfit like this. I think it's so adorable. I got it for $5. This purse at Rue 21 and I fell in love with it. I think it looks so expensive. It's very just western feel. It's adorable. My Nana is super high fashion. Like my Nana gets her clothes from Nordstrom's, Bloomies, Neiman Marcus and she loved this purse so I felt like my clothes look expensive because my Nana likes it. They really love this purse. It's adorable. Five dollars. So naturally I saw it in this gorgeous chestnut so yeah, I got this one too for $5. I don't wear the chestnut as much, like you can obviously tell that this one is less worn than this one, but they're both just gorgeous bags. They're the perfect length and I love them, so I got them both. Okay, you guys, so that is it for my Rue 21 haul, and I think this might be the last one for a while. They do have an online store, so I'm going to try to link down below everything that I can find, but I feel like one of those people who say like, the book was way better than the movie, but the store is way better than the online website. They just have so many more options. So I'll try to find what I can and I will link it down below. If you have a Rue 21, definitely um, just find out if it's closing. They said that they're closing like over a hundred stores, which is like a lot. It's really not good. I'm definitely going to miss this store. So if you enjoyed this video or if you like Rue 21, give this video a thumbs up and comment down below. Number one, have you ever shopped at Rue 21? If you have, is it going out of business? Comment whatever. I literally love talking to people in the comments. It's so much fun. Like always, I want to remind you if you're not already to subscribe, join this family. We just hit over 13K. We are well on our way to 14K and it's just, if you wanna follow me on social media, all my social media accounts are under the name at Julia Elise YT. And yeah, if you wanna see what I'm doing, I love posting on social media. It's just the best place ever. I always respond if you comment on my pictures, etc. I hope you all have a great day, an even better week, and I'll catch up with you all later.